Makoshika Park manager Ryan Sakalowski was out one day when he noticed an interesting looking bug. Well, I picked it up and uh, I recognized it immediately from movies that uh, this is definitely, it looks like a scorpion. While it may surprise many that Montana has a native scorpion, zoologist Bryce Maxwell has been looking for them for the last few years. We found them at a lot of rock outcrops that we've been surveying across eastern Montana. And even though the records are pretty scattered right now, it does look like their distribution is uh, basically across eastern Montana and usually in drier habitats. These scorpions are nocturnal, so one of the best ways to find them is at night with a black light. And while little is known about why they glow, these little bugs are much more complex than one would think. They're very temperature dependent. As soon as the temperatures get too cold, they're gonna go inactive. They'll become active in the spring when the temperatures uh, rise. Well, another one of their complex behaviors is that they often will carry their, their uh, young around on their backs with them. These scorpions will use their stinger to capture a variety of prey. However, to humans, this stinger is not deadly. With that in mind, Sokolowski enjoys looking for these scorpions. Oh, okay, here's the scorpion now. And one day hopes to have a display in Makoshika so everyone can see Montana's scorpion. Winston Greeley, out among Montana's fish, wildlife, and parks.